What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Michael Knapp Fishing. Uh, today we are going to do an unboxing video. We have got the latest Warriors Tackle Supply uh, box. Uh, we're going to go ahead and crack it open and check out what all is in there. Sounds like it's a good one guys, let's go. So, uh, it, for those of you that remember last month, um, we did a, we partnered up with uh, Warriors Tackle Supply, and uh, it's a monthly subscription box. They have three, uh, three or four different uh, levels. Um, sorry, I didn't mean to talk at you with a knife, <laughs> but uh, three or sorry about that. I tell y'all, my phone doesn't ever go off when I'm fishing, and now when I'm recording a video, it's gone off twice. <laughs> Let me. Let me just do this a favor real quick. I'll put that on vibrate. Okay, so uh, last month's box was just jam-packed full of stuff. And oh, man, this month again, it is jam-packed full of all kinds of goodies. So first one up, this is a hair jig of some kind. Uh, it's got a free swinging head. It's called the Freedom, Freedom Customizable Swim Jigs. Um, that is an awesome looking little bait. That's for sure. It's called the Hydra Shad hair jig. Um, let's just open this up real quick, just like this and check her out. Look at that. Now that is cool. It's got the, the free swinging head on it. Uh, I, I bet that's got some killer action in the water. That looks really good. Nice feathers, uh, good looking hook. That's a really nice bait. I like that a lot. All right, next bait is a, a Max Lure Crank X. Uh, it looks like a kind of a modified style of a square bill. That that lip kind of just looks a little different. Looks a little, comes in a little bit more. It's not a traditional uh, square bill. Um, look, it looks really good too. What else do we got in here? Oh, we've got another uh, Weston, um, I can't remember really what we decided to start calling these things, but they're kind of like swim baits, but kind of not. Um, it, it's it's not segmented or anything like that. It's one piece, but when it comes through the water, it just kind of glides back and forth. Really cool bait. Uh, this is a uh, one and eighth ounce, four inch, and it. Uh, Let's see here, what's it dive to? So it can go from 0.5 meters to two meters, somewhere around in that range, like three feet. Uh, yet again, you know, we used it last time and uh, it, it was actually a lot of fun. All right, so the next bait up is uh, by Bass Hick. Um, it is a cute, just a cool little uh, popper style bait, uh, real little. These squirrels sound like they're freaking elephants out here, man. They're crazy. Uh, real little popper. Uh, it does have a feathered treble hook on the back. It's got a little chartreuse and orange up there. I like it a lot. Really nice bait. Um, I think that's all we've got for hard baits. I think everything else in here is soft baits. Yeah, okay, so everything else in here is soft baits. So next up, we have another Weston bait. Uh, they call this the Curl Tees. Um, it's a, it's a nice little, uh, it, it's a good take on a grub. Um, this is something that I would put on like the back of my spinner bait, or I would fish with, um, like just a straight jig head. I know not a lot of people do that anymore, but it's a, uh, ultra finesse presentation and technique that not a lot of people do anymore. And I still do it every now and then trying to get those few extra bites, but, uh, nice little bait, um, nice curl tail, ribbon tail, however you want to phrase that. I like I like that. That's a nice little bait. All right, so the next bait is by Sweet Spot Tackle. I uh, can't see this. We actually gonna have to open this up. It is a, another plastic bait, and it looks to me like it's a drop shot bait. Um, oh, yeah, look at that. That's nice. Check that little dude out. Uh, it, it looks like a hand pour. Um, it, it's very slender and sleek. It's got nice scent to it. Uh, that that's a that's a killer drop shot bait right there when the water's clear. I, I like that a lot. And uh, they actually gave you, I think they gave you like eight of them. That's a pretty good, 
pretty good setup right there. Uh, I, that's that's actually really nice. We're probably going to use that later on. What in the world? <laughs> All right, these are by Fresh, and these are scorpions. Um, I've never fished a scorpion before. I, I've never actually seen a scorpion in the wild, to be honest. So, not 100% sure how we'll rig these. Oh, these, this is not going to be an easy one to open. There we go. But, uh, oh, look at, the, look at the tails on it. That's cool. Let me see if you can see that. You see the tails kind of sticking up in there. That's cool. Um, like I said, I've, I've never actually seen a scorpion out here. I've never fished with one before, but uh, we'll definitely give that a shot. I like those a lot. Uh, those are really cool bait. They recommend you rig them on a uh, three-aught offset EWG hook, you know, a nice wide hook, um, and you just go th right through the belly on them. Um, but like I said, that, that's a really, really cool. It's an awesome bait, cool bait. I'm just, you know, I don't really know how, how well that's going to work down here. <laughs> okay, so I had no idea that, uh, that this bait was going to be in here. Um, for those of you who watched uh, last, was it last week's? I'm trying to remember when I'm publishing this video. Anyway, last week or two weeks ago, you all know that I signed a new partnership with Chase Baits. And I didn't know that this was gonna be in the box this week, but we have some Chase Baits products. Um, this is their plastics, and I haven't actually gotten to use any of their plastics yet, because I went with almost all hard bodies in uh, and the, um, TPE material, um, I, I wanted, uh, I had a plan on how I was going to do my partnership with them and everything, so I knew what I wanted, um, but these, I've, I've heard a lot of good things about these, um, I'm struggling to open it now, see, I don't know if this is TPE or not, that's why I want to open it, because my curiosity is getting the better of me, alright, that'll be enough that I can get one out. There we go. Ooh. All right, so no, this is not TPE. No, all right, this is not TPE, but it's uh, still feels like a fairly sturdy plastic. Uh, that, that's just a cool little bait. Now, what what they're known for are these ribs over here, and they just kind of flutter down in the water column. Really cool. Um, this this is I think this is more for a saltwater angler, but we'll give it a shot out here in freshwater you know bass they don't care they'll eat anything so uh yeah we're gonna give that a shot we will uh we'll texas rig this more than likely um probably put like a four aught hook in it ewg hook three eighths ounce texas rig and we'll probably chuck these around a little bit some around some brush piles and whatnot just a little something different that those bass have i guarantee you the bass haven't seen this before so uh that's definitely something cool that uh, we're gonna try out and keep in mind i'm never going to get that back in there and to wrap out the box uh they gave us a uh neck guard the uh face masks um here i'll just go ahead and open it real quick for you guys there you go the warriors tackle supply face shield real nice stretch to it I like those a lot. I'm, I'm glad they sent me another one. Um, but anyway, guys, so that was the uh, that was this month's uh, box from Warriors Tackle Supply. And as you can tell, it was so big that there was so much stuff in it that it couldn't even fit in their little red box. They had to actually send it in a in a big box for me. Um, but that that's the pro box, guys. I, I'm not sure how much it retails for, but uh, I'll leave the link down in the description below for you guys to check out this box. And there are two other boxes. I believe it's a total of three boxes. You can check them all out at Warriors Tackle Supply. And uh, guys, do me a huge favor. Go check them out. If you guys are into it, order your pack. You can try it. I think you can do it monthly, bi-monthly. You might even be able to do it quarterly. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure they have all kinds of different lengths of plans. Guys, if you like these videos, do me a huge favor. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Leave me a comment down in the comment section below. Let me know if you guys have used Warriors Tackle Supply before. Let me know if you all ordered one from the last box last time. Go down there in the comment section. Let me know, guys. I appreciate y'all watching this. Take care, guys.